Good morning friends this is Amrit your German education mentor today i am here in the city of Karlsruhe and i have mr nimay hinduja with me student of kit karlsruhe institute of technology and i'm always very proud of my students who are studying in one of the best institution around the world like kit he will tell us about what kit is i will show you he has shown us his campus Raj has shown his campus of KIT, so I'm very happy that they both are studying over here and doing best in their fields. So let's talk to him. How are you? So I'm doing great. Okay. Uh, so tell us, tell our student in which uh, field you are studying. Yeah. So I'm currently doing my bachelor's in electrical engineering and information technology. I am in the third semester. I just started my third semester about two weeks ago, and in this semester I have five subjects. and uh, every subject offers me a deep insight into uh, information tech into uh, electromagnetic wave theory into applied mathematics into electrical machines and current devices and so i believe in my opinion this should be one of my best semesters because in this semester i will get to know more and more about the stuff that i have studied previously in the first and second semesters i personally like um, uh linear electrical circuits the most and so in this chance uh, in this semester i will get a chance to explore more about uh circuits and stuff that i uh, that i build up on in the first and second semester so i hope that uh, it goes well in this semester Wish you luck that this semester will be a great. Ah, uh, thank you, sir. Thank <laughs> you. <laughs> okay, so tell us how you're feeling in KIT. What's your feeling uh, in studying ge- in uh, Germany? It's one of the best university. Ah, uh, so I've been here since uh, two years in Karlsruhe. I did my student colleague here, which is a preparatory course before you enter the university. Ah, uh, and I have to say it was one of the best. one of the best experiences i've had in my life doing my studian colleague and my bachelor's both here because the things that i get to learn in terms of theory practical and just life in general meeting new people and everything is just been the best experience by far because as i came here i was not sure what was going to happen but as i met new new people from different countries as i got to talk to professors more as i got to explore what i like i realized that this is indeed what education should be about that you should be able to explore and uh, you should be uh, you should get to know what you love and so yeah in the past 2 years i must say i've gotten to know a lot of stuff uh in theory in practical and yeah so it's been a great journey so far nima i have a question yes sir that there are total nine excellent universities of germany which yeah. is tu9 yeah so what was the reason that you have selected kit okay so i think so personally yeah. that yeah. i have been to germany mm-hmm. i have studied my bachelor's over here Every time I met the students of KIT, they say that KIT studying in KIT is very difficult. Mm. So, what's your thought on that? Yes, it's true that it's difficult studying here. But I would say the things that you would get to know aside from the theory is just exceptional. Because, for example, in the last semester, I got to do a project on uh, embedded systems. Uh, I got to work on the Texas Instruments Tiva M M Cortex Arm Cortex uh, microcontroller, which, if if you are aware of, is uh, one of the uh, beginners' projects. Your uh, your uh, your entry guide into uh, embedded world. Uh, I got to work with two other German students on this project, and uh, it was a eye opener. in that project i got to learn c++ as a programming language on a on not just a school level but on a application level like how do you execute big projects so this was for me it was a big project because i dis- i practically wrote the code for the microcontroller which uh, which is used in segways and stuff so this was a big programming co- uh, big programming uh, project for me that i got to do with uh, two really uh, bright german students 
and uh, so i would say in terms of practical knowledge i would not get this kind of knowledge anywhere else the knowledge that i've gained here in the first two semesters is just exceptional I, my father is also an electrical engineer and i've had talks with him about this and he says that he got to know about this stuff after he did his bachelor's or after he did his fourth semester or fifth or sixth but i got i get to do that in the first two semesters so just just the things that you will get to learn practically is i think one of the best parts about kit theory is also exceptional here you also get to learn uh more about subjects than any other tu9 universities because kit is one of those universities that has now really it upgrades its course every semester so every semester you have different subjects you learn as per the technology so kit is one of the trend setting universities in terms of uh, updating their course up, uh, in changing their faculty changing their professors as per the courses so overall everything i would say no other university in the tu9 group offers these things as kit does okay so how you came to us <laughs> so i went to the uh, as raj raj mentioned earlier about the seminar i also got to uh, know about amrit sir and his team of itech through this uh, german seminar and uh, yeah that is where i uh, where i saw du berlin being introduced for the first time to my eyes and that's when i decided decided that i want to study in germany in a german taught program and that's where i pursued my uh, goal of studying in germany so you if you so i can imagine that if you have not came to came in our seminar yeah then, in which university you would be studying <laughs> if i would have <laughs> if, if i didn't show up to the seminar i would be studying in bombay in nmims which is not really <laughs> a good university <laughs> compared to kit it stands nowhere near it so i'm very thankful that i got to meet amrit sir and aman ma'am through this seminar yeah thank you and uh, can you tell us uh, about the experience by studying in a german thought program in kit in such a difficult uh, university yeah so for that i have to thank amrit sir once again because he he set us up with uh, eurasia institute in berlin where i did my language course which is a really good institute for uh, learning german because they they have a intensive german program up till the uh, uh, level c1 which is like the one of the top levels for german language there's also a level c2 higher than that but if you can learn german german till c1 you can you can really speak fluent german so in berlin i got to learn learn german at eurasia institute which was also a great experience there i got to meet many new people many new friends from different countries and that's that's where for the first time i got to interact with foreigners in general so from there i would say from there on it the journey has been just remarkable the things that i've learned the language my studies the people that i've met the profess everything from there has just been awesome so learning thank you it <laughs> was great <laughs> yeah thank you so can you tell us what's your future plan yeah so i'm actually planning to do my masters in kit as well in micro and nanotech because that's one of the core subjects that has interested me since the past year uh i have a professor his name is dr w- uh, dr wunsch uh he he taught me uh, uh electronische schaltungen that's the subject that i did in second semester and i had a talk with him one day about just about uh how this subject would look like in the upcoming years and what uh jobs can you get if you are specializing in micro and nanotech so I got to have a talk with him and few other master students from that institute the institute for micro and nanotech in KIT and that's where I decided that uh that I want to do something in micro and nanotech yeah so I wish you luck thank you very much sir <laughs>